I'm just gonna ask the question, what are your thoughts about me streaming on YouTube? And see, I feel like this is like the crazy question to answer because it's just like I've been flip-flopping back and forth, should I, should I not? And then I'm just have reached the point where I'm like, you know what? How about you just ask? And for the record, guys, I am reading the comments very keenly. Like, what are your thoughts on me streaming here on YouTube? And I don't want people to worry about massaging it or being overly positive or, or overly nice. I want your actual thoughts. Like, where I'm at personally with YouTube is this community really makes me happy beyond words. Like, I have already streamed on this channel literally a year ago when I was much, 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 much smaller, and I really enjoyed it a lot. <laughs> and please don't search out this video. I cringe into oblivion. I'm one of those people that really, really rarely unlists or privates a video <laughs> so I cringe into oblivion every time I see this I forced myself to stream with my hair greasy I threw on a hat I was just like it's gonna be patch morning it was like 4 o'clock a.m. and I was absolutely not ready in any capacity but I threw myself into the fire and this is what we call definition textbook definition of cringe it's a good thing that I actually like learn how to like laugh at myself about it because oh my god what a train wreck but for real guys streaming here like what do you all actually think about it will it scare you off will it make you unsubscribe like it might make you angry is what I'm thinking would the notifications be a bother just like oh my god Cole is literally starting to stream again I <laughs> hits unsubscribe button and like blocks and like bans and I, do, I don't even know. It's really, that's kind of like what my mentality is. It's just like, it's like, I don't send out notifications that often on like places like Discord. Like you're really rarely gonna see me, like even if I'm replying to someone, I will like actively hit the reply button and then I will like hit the like notification off because I'm so scared about pissing people off with notifications. And like really that is the last thing that I wanna do. It's just like, how to say it? I, like I am literally just looking for feedback here. Like, when you have a good thing going, you don't want to mess it up. And I've received pretty monumental feedback from people saying that they do want to see me stream. They want, <laughs> how to say, they like my particular form of stupid that has leaked out in some videos. And streaming is all about interaction. And I literally live for this amazing community. I love interacting. When I say, like, Final Fantasy XIV saved my life, and yes, I'm citing that video again, like, you guys are such an instrumental part in me feeling, like, good. And it's just, like, it's so crazy because it's just, like, I, I also am a new creator, and I really have no ties to anywhere other than here. And I don't have your fancy butt Twitch or partner program or ultra premium boosted rates for subs or whatever, or any recurring Twitch subs. Like, I literally have no ties or obligation or anything there. Like, if someone has ever claimed to be me there, it's just like, they are a charlatan, unless I'm lurking in your streams and what. It's just like, shout out to like, so many streamers. Like, if I start that, this video will actually be like 10 minutes long. But you know, some of, I love some of y'all. But it's just like, have I ever really done a Twitch stream? Oh uh, no. Anyone has that he, you have like subbed to or donated to that has claimed to be me is a complete charlatan. Unless they are Cole Evix on Gilgamesh, that person is full of it. I mean, I know I'm such a handsome, attractive young man. <laughs> I can't imagine anyone actually wanting to be this squeaky though. But for real guys, like I've been doing YouTube videos for a bit over a year and to be honest, I'm honestly just thankful. It's just like, it's Thanksgiving here in Canada very shortly and I'm honestly so thankful though. And it's just like every Thanksgiving for now, it's gonna be like, thank you. Thank you so much for giving me this opportunity, but it's just like, I am so happy people resonated with my content. It's like when I began, I literally never expected to pass even 300 subscribers. It's like, and yes, you heard right, 300. I never expected to pass that number. It's just like, I was like at like 50 subs at the time. And it was just like, you know what? I'm happy and so thankful for even this. And I'm just like, you know what? I made peace with it. I'm just like, I will never pass 300 subs. Then we passed that. Then we passed 500, then 1,000, then 3,000, then 5,000, then 10,000. And I'm still at the point where it's just like, people are like, oh, where's your like 10K celebration video? And I'm like, I I'm still trying to even process that we got here. And now we're just at just under 13K. And my br brain literally goes, uh, 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 uh what? And it's like, this isn't even with the website out. This is like driving me crazy because it's just like, people are like, where is the guide content? You used to do this. And I'm like, I have not stopped. I've been going non-stop in the background. It's just, it really sucks because you, until it's out, no one knows what you're doing. But at the risk of being too repetitive is I am scared of ruining this by streaming here. This is amazing. The community here is amazing. I made a video that I unlisted a week ago where honestly I did cry after a pretty upsetting and disturbing thing happened, which 
complicated situation boiled down really simply was parasocial relationships are really fucking dangerous and it's just like sometimes people will have a very um unfortunate opinion about you even though you've never said anything wrong about them and i'm still not going to say anything wrong about them i think that they're really great but um sometimes people will just not like you for characteristics about you that you really have no choice about and you know what i have to make peace with that but um the what i got through the comment section of that video like i have literally gone back and forth should i just like and reply to every single comment in here but then i'm just like oh my god i don't want to piss people off with notifications and see that's really a big hang up with me is it's just because like years ago it's just like i used to be really active and i used to have like all these things and it's just like i've really internalized like oh my god if you send a notification to a person like this person will like literally hate you but the point is it's just like through that video i saw so much love and so much kindness and it's just like Seriously, you are all such a blessing. And I'm I'm literally saying this completely unscripted, dead ass. Like you are actually such a blessing to my life. I am so fucking thankful for all of you. I really am. But like if I streamed here, it would be boring until I really got my groove on. It's just like I do have the ability to talk. I was really like I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I really didn't talk to people, especially growing up. But it's like when I started volunteering because I was really going for medical school and then I ended up being a med school dropout. Haha. <laughs> how funny how time flies. <laughs> But I really had to learn how to talk to people and how to be like bubbly and positive through literally learning bedside manner. And I was just a volunteer at the time, so I kind of cringe at saying that. But it's like I volunteered at a hospital locally, um, literally with dying people. And it's just like I had to learn how to talk. I had to learn how to be positive, how to be bubbly, even in the face of someone literally suffering or someone with like severe Alzheimer's disease. And it's just like I literally had to learn these things. So like... The problem, though, is talking to a person face to face where you can see their movements, you can see their pupils dilate or contract, like, you can see the muscles, all these things, like, it's just, like, people say, like, uh, oh, what is it? It's, like, 90%, like, 95% of all statistics are made up on the spot, and you bet that that's one of them, but it's just, like, people say, like, 90% of communication is completely not the actual thing. It's things like tone, it's things like body posture, it's things like eye rolling, things like these non-verbal, not or rather, non- literal verbal content cues so like talking to camera is so freaking awkward but i'm sorry guys now i'm just rambling but if you would please just let me know what your thoughts are on me streaming he like here on youtube in particular like please let me know like will it scare you off will it make you unsubscribe might it make you angry with the notifications like would the notifications be a bother i've been i've tried to look up ways to like not notify people because it's just like i literally don't want to annoy anyone but for real guys, I'm just looking for some feedback, I'm just looking for some input. I know that this video is very raw, very unscripted, and it's very impromptu, but it's just like, I I kind of want to know this, because I am literally going to be starting to stream in probably a week. Like, it's just like, the website is just about done, you're going to see it probably one of the biggest and scariest videos I have ever edited, because it means so much to me personally. Um, Ultimate videos are back, by the way. It's been a while, guys, but they're back. But um, you're going to see that. And then right after that, my focus is all the streaming. So I'm asking the dumb question. <laughs> Anyhow, take care, everyone. And seriously, thank you. Thank you for being here. Seriously, I, I really appreciate it so much. It, Thank you.